hi everyone and welcome back to my channel or if you're new here thank you for clicking on this video so today we have part one of my pretty little thing haul um this was only going to be one video but then i accidentally went online and bought more so now we have a two-part video so yeah without further ado let's get into the video <music> First up I'm going to show you accessories, I only bought, well technically it's a pair of shoes, I only bought one pair so I'm just going to show you this first. So I picked up these trainers. Now I have the Adidas Falcons and I really want another pair of trainers that I can wear when I don't want to wear my expensive ones. Um, I, mean, I suppose that some people are not that expensive but to me they're very expensive. Um, so I picked up these ones, now these are quite weighty, like they're really heavy, but I thought they were one of the nicer looking pairs out there. I'm not sure if I'll keep them because I don't know how much I actually do love them, but you'll probably see these in a couple of my try on clips. So if not, they were in my ASOS haul as well, you can see me with wearing them there. So, so that is it for the shoes. So we're just going to move on to clothing. Okay, there's literally no particular order to this, so we're just going to have to get through it. Also, there's a lot to get through, so I'm just going to try and like rattle them off as I go on. So next up, I bought this, what is it, like velour material? So I bought this hoodie. So I bought the set, sorry. So I got the hoodie, which is just like a cream velour hoodie. It's got no pockets in it, but... I don't really mind that for this kind of thing. And then I bought velour jogger bottoms as well. So that is the bottoms for size reference. Um, most things will be down below with size reference and I am five foot three if that helps anyone. Um, I quite like the fit of these, they feel so soft. Basically I was wanting, I've been trying to get myself something that I can kind of wear Sounds really bad but like on Christmas day that can be a bit nicer than my normal things but I'm not sure if we have a winner here or not but I'm definitely going to try. Again so soft and I really need to keep going so moving on. So next up if you've been watching my hauls for a bit you know that I've been trying to find some really nice black leggings that are soft. I found them. So these are from the sports section, so these are the Black Sculpt Luxe High Waist Gym Leggings and they are so soft so I'm definitely going to get more than one pair of these. I got these in a size 8, they fit me so well, like I literally can't fault these leggings at all. I'm already in love and I will be buying way more pairs because as I said before I really do just hate the feel of leggings normally so. The fact that I've gone and found these ones is an absolute miracle and I'm so happy. So next up, I actually can't believe I haven't bought myself this before. It is this kind of stone coloured, big baggy, oversized t-shirt. This could literally be a dress on me, it's that long on me. Like you'll see in the try and clips how long it is. Um, I got this in a medium and honestly, it feels good quality, love the colour. I'm loving these kind of neutral tones at the moment so yeah as I said I can't believe I don't have one of these tops in this colour because I've seen so many different ways of styling it basically the entire year so why I've not got my hands on one before is I can't believe it. So next up you won't see a try on clip with this purely because I couldn't get it on. So I bought black ribbed flare trousers Um, yeah I just love the flare on trousers I think they're so flattering however these ones just simply do not fit me I couldn't get them up past my thighs um which is that weird because usually that they're really stretchy but no I got a size 8 for reference so if you think that you look similar sizes to me then size up that's all I'm saying but I find it so bizarre though because sometimes I'll get a size 10 and it's way too baggy on me so I don't know so back to t-shirts, I'm sorry this is going to be really choppy, um, so back to t-shirts I've got a, another t-shirt and a medium, now 
this is a bit too small for not small for me I like my oh I like t-shirts oversized and this is not oversized enough for me so it's just this t-shirt it says baby girl on it I li literally bought this because I want the jumper I didn't get the jumper so yeah um I think it's quite cool though for like a little graphic t-shirt I love the colors of it um also, it's a really soft t-shirt. I find some of the tops that I have from Pretty Little Thing before are quite harsh material, but that one's not harsh. I find that one quite soft, so bonus points for that. Okay, next up we have another two-piece set. So, let me pop this back together. So I bought this jogger and matching bodysuit set in this green colour. So, let's talk about the joggers first. I bought the joggers in a size 10 because as you know I like things to be big and comfortable and um, so it's just this green colour jogger it cinches in at the bottom and it has the pretty little thing logo here very soft I love the feel of it really fleecy on the inside the drawstrings do work the only thing is it doesn't have any pockets which I kind of don't like because pockets are always handy especially with joggers I love having pockets however I think the fit and the shape of these are so nice that it doesn't bother me too much. And then obviously to go with that is the bodysuit. So this is the bodysuit. The bodysuit was a bit tight on me. So the bodysuit I got in a 10 as well. And it's really tight. Like I really struggled getting this over my head. However, I kind of like the tight look of it. But I would maybe size up in this bodysuit because as I said before... It was just so tight and hard to get on and it wasn't really worth it, I don't think. So I would definitely size up in the bodysuit, but I love those paired together. I just love matching tracksuits. You can't really go wrong, can you? They look so nice. So while I'm speaking about bodysuits, I got two long-sleeved jersey bodysuits. So the first one I got was just a plain black long-sleeved bodysuit, really soft, stretch material. And then the other one I got was in this chocolate brown colour. Um, I only have a try on clip with a chocolate brown colour because I did buy the same size in them. So I didn't see the point of doing two clips for the one thing. So that's the chocolatey brown colour there. Again, I'm loving this colour that's in season right now. I think it goes with the neutrals so well. It's, what I will say about this is the 10s I think are too big for me in these bodysuits. Yeah, they're too tight for me in the other bodysuit for what... Yeah, they're too tight for me with other bodysuits, so definitely watch out for that. Because, I don't know if you can see in the try-on clip, but this, these are actually quite baggy in me, so I think I'm going to get an 8 in these. But I've noticed with tight bodysuits that an 8 tends to be too tight on me, so. So I'm actually really surprised that the 10 before was too tight, yet yeah, those ones are too baggy, but I guess that's kind of why we do hauls like this. So next up, I think this is one of my favourite ones. So I bought this. Um, jumper, I don't know what kind of material this is, I don't know what it says, eyelash knit, I have no idea what that means, but it basically it's this grey roll neck jumper, hmm. and it's so fluffy and it's not itchy at all and I absolutely love it, like I adore it, I think it looks so nice on. And as I say, it's so soft, not itchy, which is always a gamble with knitted jumpers like this. But I love the colour of it as well. Like it's such like a light grey. It's almost lilac-y grey. But yeah, I love that. And then another thing I bought, which I think was just like a last minute thing in the basket, was this shirt. So it is a stone pocket oversized shirt in size 10. But it's such like a strange material. But I love this material. It's so soft. It flows well and I feel like I could get a lot of use out of this like obviously you can wear it over things and style it certain ways in the winter but then I even thought this color and this material over like a white bikini if I was on holiday would look so nice honestly I'm really pleasantly surprised with this it's such a nice fabric I did get this in a size 10 for size reference also it's so big on me that I could technically wear cycle shorts underneath it and wear it as like a dress so basically one thing five outfits or more so if that's not a bargain I don't know what is 
so back to matching sets this is kind of a pajama slash loungewear set um this is part of like the mix and match um range i don't know if it's a mix and match range but basically you buy them separately and there's loads of different options so the first thing i got were these trousers so they're size 10 they've got a pretty little thing band here and they're pink check obviously and they're really just wide leg long trousers now these are very long on me but and they're also very baggy on me like these are literally falling off of me but i prefer pajamas like that like i prefer it to be falling off me because i find it hurts my stomach if it's too tight especially when i'm sleeping so these are honestly perfect for me and then to go with that i bought this sweatshirt in a size 10 as well but then this felt really tight on me i really struggled with this one like that's a size 10 i don't think this looks like a size 10 at all it doesn't feel like a size 10 either like it's really i really struggled with it so this is the pale pink check lounge sweatshirt um it is really nice it's really pretty it's very thin material so if you are wanting to wear it as pajamas like it's just normal pajama kind of material it's very soft material actually but it's not thick and fleecy because you don't really want that if you're sleeping in it so next up i think i mentioned before i'm trying to find like casual trousers um, in another video so i picked up this pair of black trousers got that awful tag on it that I do get why they do it but it's very annoying so it just has like an elasticated waist um does this actually work yeah the ties actually work it does have pockets the only thing is the length on me but I am five foot three as I said before so I'm not surprised yeah I just thought I'd try something new like just comfy trousers to wear around the house when I don't want to wear joggers but I don't want to wear jeans and be restricted and uncomfortable so I kind of thought if I can get my hands on a couple of casual trousers and just kind of figure out how to wear them and style them and make them look okay I thought I'd try it, I thought I'd give it a go um, you'll probably find out so sticking with trousers, kind of um, I picked up these grey marl leggings but they have a split hem at the bottom so I got these in a size 10 um, I feel like size 10 fits me quite well and just at the bottom it's got the side split now obviously these are a little bit long for me so I will have to take them up but they've got such a big split that I can actually take it up and still have the split on the end which is perfect and uh, not much I can say about this they don't have that horrible legging material that I absolutely hate so another bonus the only frustrating thing about getting grey things like this is you literally have so many different shades of grey so, I feel like I look very washed out. Okay, I feel like I've done a good job at getting through all of this because I'm onto my last two items. But remember, this is only part one. Last two items, I got two hoodies. So, these were the extreme oversized hoodie. The ultimate, sorry, the ultimate oversized hoodie. And because it said it was ultimately oversized, I got the small in both. I think everyone has a weird definition or a different definition of oversized because these aren't oversized to me like they are they're not fitted they are bigger than normal but I should have sized up for the oversized fit that I wanted but here is the grey one I got this to go with the leggings they're a different shade of grey what's new and then I got a black one so there's loads of different colours and it does have pockets in that so but I think I'm gonna get a size bigger for it because as I said before it's not oversized enough because I'm fussy like that but I feel like their hoodies are such like good quality they're soft they're fleecy inside again can't complain about it so that is everything for part one of my pretty little thing haul I really hope you guys enjoyed it and Stay tuned for part two if you want to see that. I have no idea when it's going to be live. But if you subscribe, put the notification bell on, you'll get a notification when I upload the part two. So stay tuned for that. Thank you so much for watching my video and I will see you in my next one.